Hello, I'm Rob Wallace and today I'm going to show you how to make a design like this on one of the Corsage Creations retro bracelets. Let's have a little look at the items you'll be needing. What we have here is two pieces of topsy-turvy leaves, two pieces of dazzle line, two green van der orchids, believe it or not this is carnations, a little selection of Cullen Coe heads, Akara's Kisses Delightful, obviously the glue and the retro bracelet. You'll notice that I've placed the retro bracelet onto a tube from the Corsage Creations display rack. I've tied off the ribbon and removed the excess because I won't need it in this design. Next we add in one floret from a blue van der orchid and a second one being pre-glued so sticks in place quite firmly. I'm then going to add in some green carnations and I'm not going to in this design put any more foliage in as it's going to detract from the focal orchid which is about to sit on top of this carnation that I've just put in. You can see how easily this is going together. One of the main flower components of the design that we're working with today. Gluing together and now adding in a little bit of sparkle, i.e. the topsy-turvy leaves. Just pushing it so it goes underneath the ribbon whilst the glue is going off. A returned end topsy-turvy leaf going in to make almost a little Hogarth curve design going through it. So you've got that lazy S just slipping its way. Then we have the Kara's Kisses Delightful. A gorgeous little product here and this the white of this actually brings in the white of the retro bracelet. Not quite finished yet but we're nearly there. Just one or two florets of white Kalankoe, some people say Kalanchu, and this again is just bringing that white colour through. Working on a design such as this white retro bracelet, you need something a little bit larger to keep in proportion with the width of it, and this is something that someone who was really funky and way out, this is the sort of thing they would wear, Named retro because it comes from the period of the 50s and influenced by it. But you can see how quick and easily this is going together. And just to give it another little tiny little bit of a finish, I'm going to add two pieces of dazzle line in because when the arm is moved, this dazzle line will dance and sparkle and just put a little bit of movement into the completed arrangement on the top of the retro bracelet. Bear with me a minute, I'll just put this second one on. Isn't this easy to do? Can you imagine doing this the traditional way when you'd be taping and putting gutter call on? And this design that I produced in minutes would have taken at least 15 to 20 traditional ways. Here's the final design. The transparent disc was covered with van der leaves and carnations. Topsy-turvy leaves were added. Van der orchids was placed into the focal area. A little bit of dazzle line adds a little pizzazz. And to finish, I've added that Kara's Kisses Delightful. So that's it for today. Look forward to seeing you next time.